Rock on Intermediate 2 tutorial. Um, I'm going to go through some grooves, fills, and structure of the song. Um, I'm going to break down the, the grooves so to make them to start from the beginning, so make them really simple and building them. Because there really is just one groove in this piece. Okay, and this is bar 11. Bar 11. It's going to go like this. Okay, the hi hat is going to be going one, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four, and one, and two, and three, and four. And I'm going to put the snare on two and four. One, two, three, four. One, and two, and three, and four, and. Okay, now when we're comfortable with that, I'm now going to add the bass drum on one and three. Okay, I'm going to do a bit slower. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, so that's our basic eight groove rock groove. Okay, so I'm just going to develop it a wee bit by adding in an extra quaver in the bass drum on the two hand. Sounds like this. One, two, Three, four, one, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four. Okay, and then to develop even more, I'm going to put in the two semiquavers at the end of the bar on the four and, and I'm going to do it right left. One, two, three, four, one, two, and three, four, one. Okay, so that is their pattern there as written. The next bar, exactly the same, but from the four and you have an open hi hat. Okay, um, and that's quite difficult to develop, to develop, but basically both your feet are going to come up and down at the same time. Okay, so bar 12 sounds like this. Okay, so I'm not going to play, play bars 11 and 12, but leave out the crash symbol in the first beat of 11, and that's a two bar phrase. And this two bar phrase is played all the way through to 34. Okay, and here's how this two bar phrase goes one, two, three, four. Okay, when you've got that, you can add in the crash symbol on the first beat of the bar, in bar 11, which sounds like this, one, two, three, four. Okay, so that is our basic groove from 11 through to 34. The groove at bar 3 it's exactly the same, except we don't play the snare drum on beat three. Uh, sorry, in beat two. It's only played on beat four. Okay, so no snare drum on beat two. Um, from bars three through to ten. One, two, three, four. Okay. One more groove, bars 35 through to 39, um, we've got the right symbol. I'm just going to play it sort of pretty basic at the moment. I'm not going to put in any of the off beats and the semiquavers in the right symbol. I'm just going to play it like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, So that's basically exactly the same as bar 12, but I'm playing the 8 on the right symbol. Okay? 
Now what's written is slightly more difficult in that we play on the offbeat and on the offbeat three and we have two semiquavers, so it sounds like this. One, two, three, four, one. So that's quite difficult, so that's going to be further down the line, okay? Um, now fills, um, in this music we have a stave above a stave, it's what we call an Asaya bar. Um, so for example bar 10 has got a stave above it, it's not an extra stave, it's the same stave. We just have a written fill in the st uh, stave above and underneath we just have slashes and we can make them up. So we can make up our own fills or play the written ones. When starting off, it's best to do the simple. So I'm just going to play a very simple fill at bar 10, not the written one. One, two, three, four. Okay, four sets of semi, uh, two sets of semi quavers. Play that again. One, two, three, four. All I did that time was swap the second lot of semi quavers onto Tom Tom <coughs> one. Bar 18, we need to stop on the third beat of the bar because the whole band stopped there. So if we do something like this. One, two, three, four. Okay, now the fills in bars 26 and 34 we could use the same as what we did um, for bar 10 at the moment. Something like this. One, two, three, four. Okay? And we could do the same in the um, first time bar, which is bar 40. We've got hits with a band on the first two beats, which goes one, two, three, four. Okay, and after that we can use the same fill. One, two, three, four. Okay. Now the written fills are a bit more complicated, <coughs> but again, you can play them if you wish. And they go like this. This is bar ten. One, two, three, four. Okay. Bar eighteen. Sounds like this. One, two, three, four. Bar 26 sounds like this. One, two, three, four. Bar 35 sounds like this. One, two, three, four. And the fill um, and bar 40 sounds like this. One, two, three, four. Okay, so that's we covered basically everything in this track. Um, look out for the repeat from bar 40, which goes back to bar 27. And then look when you get to bar 39, for the second time, you jump bar 40 and go into the last bar. Okay. So, just recapping, basic groove to learn, to play along with this piece, goes like this. One, two, three, four. Everything else we add into that is extra and will be developed through time.